I did a Google search on dragon skeleton found. And there we got a baby dragon dinosaur found inside giant egg. 50 foot dragon dinosaur, Chinese farmers, Alberta, China, North Iceland, Romania. We did a Diablo Ceratops. Head looks like, the skull looks like a, a dragon, but when you look at the body, it looks more like a hippo, something like that, but with a funny head. Then there was the Dresserex. There's a children's museum in Indianapolis that has one. And the head looks like a dragon. And here we got a a fossil dragon. Now that definitely looks like a dragon fossil, right? Then I started coming across all these strange things. Mystery sea creature washes up on Russian beach. Right? And then Here's another one. This was in Aberdeen. Figure out what the 30 foot washed up remains are. And then we got another one here. This dragon skeleton was discovered in Chinese Sea. Bring it up a little bit more. Has 153 joints. And then came across this North Wales an authentic skeleton of what scientists admit must be the dragon of myth and legend has been unearthed by archaeologists in Snedonia region the bones are dated to be about 2,000 years assume their myths to be based on dinosaur remains but the medieval Christian knights like dragon slayers such as the legendary Saint George may have been responsible for wiping out the dragon species from the earth entirely and what else we oh and here's another one It's doing it. Oh, commercial. And there's another one. This one washed up on the beach, also. We don't know what that is either. But I did find a lot of these when I was looking for dinosaur, which I thought was quite interesting. All right, I hope you thought this was interesting. It's definitely unique. I learned some stuff that I didn't know. Hey, 2,000 years ago, there used to be real dragons, and they were wiped out. Us humans did that. We killed them all. Or I should say the dragon slayers did. <laughs>